Guys, today we're going to be playing with the twins. Well, one of them. We're not going to play with both of them, unfortunately, because they're both not ready for me yet. But uh, we're going to be driving this Subaru Brz, or the BRZ, as you probably like to call it, because that's what it is. It's a BRZ. So this thing is an absolute monster. I don't know why I haven't built one of these yet, because it's just a fantastic car. It reminds me, honestly, the BRZ and the GT86 are, to me, just the new Supras. And I know it's not exactly that, but you know what I mean? It's like the tuner cars of now. It's honestly the only new tuner car that I can think of. Like, on the top of my head, I'm like, oh, what tuner cars are there? Oh, wait, I can't think of any. So let's just go with... Oh, let's make it red. No, let's make it blue as a bruise should be. Let's buy that. And then we're going to go for a little drive in it. So, we're on adventures again. That basically means I'm going to talk and uh, drive this thing around and upgrade it as we go. Like, I'm not exactly going with a plan. I'm not going to do, like, a mass edit drift build. This is how you make a drift build. Because, obviously, we're going to drift this thing. But I'm going to drift it in a different way in the sense that I'm just going to be like, Hey, let's go drift it. This thing's a lot slower than I anticipated it to be. But, come on, it's not. I'm not going to expect it to be bloody Lightning McQueen as soon as I get going. Yeah, I actually just tried to compare a car to Lightning McQueen. Anyway, let's move on to pretend that didn't actually happen. <laughs> How is everybody doing? Hope you're doing well on the first upload of today. If everything goes to plan. Hopefully I just didn't suddenly decide to rearrange my uploads. I'm just getting hyped for the crew. Uh, it's hit me. It's the, it's the kind of 1am thing. We're going to be talking a lot, me and you. Me and you, we're going to be talking a lot. So you'll probably hear me and my ramblings of 1am. Uh, very soon, but basically, I seem to be more productive at about 1 or 2 in the morning than the rest of the whole bloody day. But, hey, I'm not complaining, it's just as long as I get my sleep, I'm all good. It's probably just because of the fact that I'm like in this mood, it's like, right, I need to shut down. Nope, let's just use the rest of the energy I made up, made, consumed during the day, because there's not much else to, for me to use it on. Except shouting into a microphone because I'm a strange person. You know what? We're going to race you, buddy. We're going to race you in your M3. Which is a lot more powerful than my BRZ, I should add. Yeah, he's 200 performance points ahead of... Yeah. All right, mate. No need to show off, okay? If that's one of you guys that subscribed to me, that's not very nice. He's taking the off-road section. That means I got a little bit more speed on him, but there's a corner that means he's just gone across and he knows the exact way to go. Jesus bloody Christ. Did not want. I'm going to cut across as well, mate. You think you're all it? Oh, no, I'm not turning around. I'm going straight through the middle. Tree. Oh, that's why he didn't go any further. There's a wall there. Let's reverse a little bit more and pretend that didn't happen. Oh, I just found a hidden thing on the right. Cancels event and oh Jesus Christ, right. So I need to rewind once more. I need a bit more of a turning circle. There we go. Yeah, he's definitely won that challenge. So that didn't really go to plan because he's in a plebby M3 that's not as plebby as my Burrs. I don't know what the hell happened physics wise there, but that does not that was not nice. Can I just quit please? Because I don't want to do this anymore. I'm gonna be embarrassed. Thank you. Anyway, uh, so th we've driven the BRZ a bit. I like I haven't driven it before uh, on the game. Like I, I, I've just driven it now. This is like the first time I've driven it. So you're experiencing a first drive once again. First drive, ladies and gents. Oh yeah, that is right. If we overtake this M3 now, I'm just gonna burst into tears. It's, it's not even. It's not even the same car. What the hell is that? I don't even know. I'm not even gonna bother turning around to look. 99.38, and that's right, buddies, that's what we got. Anyway, we should actually try. I was going to say try drift this thing, but clearly, we're going to have an issue if that's gonna how it's going to perform for the rest of it. So, let's give it a quick, quick whack around here. Yeah, this is, this is really low powered. I honestly thought this thing had a lot more power than it actually does. I don't know why, because, well, you'd look at it and you'd be like, oh, it's got a... It's a the power of a decent car, but no, apparently it's got, like, the, the power of a golf. I don't bloody know. Look at that. See what I mean? What is this? I didn't... 
Did any word in that sentence sound like Anna to you? Anna, you should bugger off and don't come back. Just stop. Like, hey, it worked. Anyway, we're gonna slide our way back very slowly to a, a customization shop. So I'm gonna go around here, actually. There's one closer if we go to the left. So it's possible, keep in mind the road is a little bit wet. She, she's wet. Probably because it's raining, not, not because of me. But we're gonna pretend it's me anyway. No chance in hell I'm going against the 4 GT40. Are you having a giraffe, mate? Clearly you are. So I've got a nice idea in my head of exactly how I want this car. I want to put a big spoiler on it. And people are like, no, don't put a spoiler on it, Leo. Let's rise. Don't rise, the boys. But I'm going to rise it. I'm going to rise, rise, rise. Not really rising, because I'm going to upgrade the performance as well. So do not worry. It's not going to be a complete total showcase. It's not just going to be like, oh my god, this looks so pretty. Drives a maximum of 110 miles an hour. Spins out in the rain because Theo can't drive. But we're driving down here. What the bloody hell is he doing? <laughs> I don't know. But it, it was kind of funny, so... Yeah. Excuse me, coming through. I doubt anybody's going to be using those for a while. Actually, to be honest, I don't think anybody's going to use them ever. Do you know why? Because I've never seen a person walking around in the street. So why have you got bus stops? Like, was there any need? Oh, was there any need? Like, seriously, I'm not going to use a bus. I don't think any of the racers here are going to use a bus. Nobody walks. All oh, they just stay there in the rain and the sun and the day and the night and they just don't want to go. I could be a song producer, cre creator, the, ri the writer of my own song. Holy crap, that's a lot of bumpers. Anyway, let's get into the actual build of this thing. Really like that one. That's just like the... the GT86 one, pretty much, isn't it? Like, <laughs> Jesus, what, what are you just stealing it? I don't understand. Oh my god. That is really reminding me of the Supra. Honestly, I don't know why. That reminds me of the RX8. <laughs> and that just reminds me of it with a little bit. It's exactly the same thing. I know. Um, I want to try that, but at the same time, I think it looks a bit weird. So I want to definitely try that. Because that just looks absolutely crazy. Though that's kind of. Subtle. You know what? We're going to go with the insane in the membrane one. We might change that. I'll probably, probably change my mind in a second. But going through these, we've got little tiny baby spoilers. And then we've got the big daddy. Oh, yeah. Just remove spoilers. No. Who would want to do that? Who would want to? I don't understand. Uh, rear bumper. That is horrible. That's quite nice. I quite like both of those. So I'm going to go with that one because it, it's just a bit more clean i don't know it's got more it's got more dints that means it's nicer <laughs> and if we go for I, I don't know i can't choose between those i think i'm gonna go with that one because it gives a bit more a bit more of a line it makes more it's more consistency throughout the body and please tell me we can have that is dreadful don't even ask me about that mate don't even ask me i want to change this front bumper honestly i'm sorry i've changed my mind i want to change it again to be honest, that doesn't look as bad as I first expected it to, but I, I don't know. I want to go... I actually think I want to keep it close to stock. That's like the first time I've ever thought, oh, I'm going to keep a tuna car close to stock because it's a bruise. It's a new thing. It's a, it's a new toy to play with. Um, do we go with that? I don't know. They're all. It looks a bit small, the car, so it doesn't really look right, but I think I'm going to go with that. Probably makes the most sense to go with that. It's not too... It's, I just oh, said it wasn't too bad, but it is. It's a bit weird. I'm going to go with that. After all that, he's going with it anyway. They all look weird. I don't understand. Help me, guys. Just help me decide. You know what? We're going with that. Final decision. Decision made. Done. Sorted. It's fine. It's okay looking. It's not amazing, but whatever. So we got the stock engine. We could go with a V8. I'm not going to put a V8 in there. Actually, what, what other options did we have? Uh, we can put turbo engines in there. It's rally engines and such. So I'm not going to do that. I'm just literally going to upgrade this thing. So, uh, main reason I wanted to drive this car, as I've already explained, but I want to say it again. This thing just... It, it's a tuna car of today to me, as I, I've, I've said. Um, and I've seen, like, everybody make a video on this car, except me. And I don't know why. I just missed the exhaust. 
because I've always wanted to try this car. It's always been a car that's like, oh, that's that's quite nice. I actually quite like those cars. I'd like to tune one of those myself. Not in real life, because it's not that I can afford that. But you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's like, oh, it's quite, it's quite a nice one, that. 400 horses. We ain't even touched the aspiration conversions yet or anything. It's like, wow. Getting, getting a bit ahead of yourself there, mate. You want to calm down? No, please don't. Just, just get even more powerful. So we're on A class still. That's not good enough. It's not good enough. I need more. Let's go for aspiration conversion. We're going with a, a single turbo. Wow. Really? You let me down. Not to worry. We'll go with your single turbo. Are you happy about that? Because I'm not. And then we should probably go back to the turbo. Upgrade. 611 horses. Upgrade the race into cooler. 635 horses. Is that everything? Do I need to do anything else after I change that? No, I, I should bloody hope not. And as for the brakes, they're kind of useful. In GTA, it would be completely different. Brakes in, in a drift car? <laughs> what are you smoking? It's obviously very high stuff. Or high class level stuff. I don't know. I don't know how you'd explain it. But in this game, you need to. You need to be able to buy all of these so you can adjust the adjustables. you got to lower it completely. I don't want to put a roll cage in there. Look, I, I just don't. But I do at the same time. You know, we're putting a roll cage. It's it's a miracle. <laughs> he's putting a roll cage and he's making it lighter. I don't know why. It's already a ridiculously small car. Change the drivetrain. Upgrades. I don't mean change it. I'm not changing it to all-wheel drive. There's no need to worry rear-wheel drive guys I'm just doing it like this anyway getting on to the crew I should probably speak about that because I'm really really excited for the, for the crew beta I don't know why because it's gonna be an open beta which basically means it's open to everybody because it's the final 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 testing of the game before it launches and the reason for that is those rims need to be a lot thicker that's not the reason. Uh, the reason is because they're going to be testing the servers, obviously. They need to test the servers before the game goes live. You know, they don't want to release the game to the millions and millions that are going to be buying this game. And for them to run into massive server issues day one. I mean, server issues have been kind of inevitable recently. But, you know, you want to get as little server issues as problem. As, as problem? As, I, don't even, I can't even speak. As little server issues as possible because <laughs> obviously you don't want people to launch the game and be like oh i can't play the game because it's an always online game and if you have an always online game and it doesn't launch right yeah there's gonna be a couple of issues there mate there's gonna be some major problems but my question is it's gonna be are you guys picking up the crew are you excited because i know bloody am it's so close now. I, I can't wait. I'm going to be doing a full Let's Play of it, if you have uh, if you haven't heard me already say that. So, if you're looking to decide to buy it after launch, and you know, you want someone to, to show you what the beauty of this game is about, then you're in the right place, brother or sister. Depending on your gender of preference of being called a male or a female i don't know uh color bonnet i want to put a carbon hood on this let's see what the carbon hood's like it's not often it's not often i actually do carbon hoods on this game anymore i used to be absolutely crazy for carbon hoods like carbon hoods and carbon everything and carbon 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 but on this it's like eh, it doesn't work too well eh, it doesn't no eh, i'll go without and i don't want to tint the windows because it's just annoying on this game so we're good my i want to i was going to call it a gt86 then my BRZ is doing swell. So let's jump out of this garage. We've been customizing for a bit. I'm pretty sure you're like, come on, Theo. This is a bit bland. Why aren't you showing us some side-to-side -side action? Some drifty, wifty, whatever you want. Some skids. <laughs> Did you ever call it that? That car did a, a, an ace skid. <laughs> I don't even know, like, the, my, is it just me? I've, did I have just the weirdest childhood? Po probably just my weird childhood. Uh, we're already on that. Let's see from the car to lock those things in place so she don't jiggle about too much. Because, obviously, if she jiggles about too much, she's going to be pushing a lot of weight. And it's going to be unpredictable. But this thing's probably going to be unpre unpredictable anyway. Do you know what? I really want to get, like, a, a design where it's, like plated around the body of this car maybe 
we should actually just design other people's tunes because apparently I can't make my own. So that's that's actually a pretty cool idea. If you guys have actually got any tunes like car setups and designs you want to send me so I can play with your car on the game, uh, be sure to upload it and let me know in the comments of this video because if you do let me know, I will know because you obviously commented and told me. Um, and I will be sure to give your tune a go in these videos. Like, I might give a couple a go of videos sometimes, or, yeah, if I'm doing an event and I need a car, I'll be like, oh, I can use Jefferson's car. I'm just assuming one of you is called Jefferson. I don't know. If anyone's actually called Jefferson, please let me know. I will give you a cookie for being called Jefferson. Here you go. Here you go, Jefferson. Thanks for being awesome. <laughs> anyway, first impressions much better it is much much better than it was like stock straight away you can tell i'm instantly getting the hang of this beautiful beautiful machine as he spins it out let's get back into control here uh we did a burnout i think it's impossible to not do a burnout on this game like all wheel drive cars it's like oh burnout rear wheel drive oh burnout front wheel drive oh burnout am i playing burnout no because I actually have never done a proper burnout in burnout. That is really... I've just Illuminati confirmed and all that jazz. Um, <laughs> I should just put the all-seeing eye on the side of this car now. It's just like every car I ever design. Sound cool? Cool. Uh, but yeah, let's, we're going to basically take it to a road I really enjoy now. Uh, which is one you've seen a couple of times. Like, there aren't that many, honestly drifting locations on this game like you'd expect there to be a lot more awesome corners for you to take like the only proper awesome place i can think of taking it is obviously the docks which isn't really a drifting place uh but i guess that was in mind when they were developing it but the actual like dock over there uh not the actual dock but you know the the seafront where you enter the game and it's got that corner it's on the trailer with the gtr going rrr, 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 around the corner that sounded magical unfortunately I didn't make it into the full game. <laughs> but, you know, it, it would have been cool to uh, to see a few more locations for drifting, like a canyon or something to drift down. Is that a bloody whale? Whoa, 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 whoa. That ain't possible. Let's go into photo mode over here. Is that a whale? I'm just going to back out because it's not a whale. I'm just going to pretend that that never happened you up. oh i leveled up oh uh, that that image yeah i saw the boat that was so awesome that boat let's just uh, do the wheel spin oh we got a wheel spin from looking at a boat how awesome is that Forty-four thousand. the look of the recording thanks guys thanks for everybody that crossed their fingers for me to get that i think that's what we should do every time i get a wheel spin on this game you guys should cross your fingers for me and be like right We've got to do our best to make sure Black Panther gets the best he possibly can. Cross your fingers, jump on one leg, say Black Panther's a boss, upload it to Vine, and then we can all laugh at you. I'm kidding. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not gonna <laughs> ask you to upload it to Vine so we can laugh at you. I'm sorry. All right, let's see if we can beat this this Mercedes. I was gonna call it a Beamer then. I just realised it's not. It's because I used to see that. I'm used to seeing that uh, black BMW from the DLC pack. We're going to drive straight past the location where I wanted to drift. So we're going to have to go back. Which is a bit of annoyance, but it doesn't matter. We get some dollar dollar beers. We make some monies, moolah, whatever you want to call it. Some some bread. I actually, I actually heard like a rap song today and it was like, talking about money as bread, like explaining the, the uh, probably like every word possible for money in, in rap terms, and it was like some bread, some cheese it's like you make a whole bloody sandwich out of your money in a minute mate, Jesus Christ <laughs> I don't understand, why, why has it got so many nicknames you've got bread you've got cheese or cheddar you've got moolah you've got Benjamins you've got I don't know anymore. Like, have you got any other words for, for money? Let me know down in the comments. That's another cool Attention topic. To okay, I got that quite a lot of money for that. Thank you ever so I much. I probably just earn most of my money back from upgrading that video. Video? Upgrading that video. I've upgraded the video. Thank you. 
upgrading this buzz. But uh, yeah, so let's make our way over to the drifting location and actually give it a little slide before we wrap up here. But as I said, if you know any names for Benjamins, <laughs> Benjamin, why, why Benjamin? Like, is, is there a king called King Benjamin and he's just got his face on a coin and something and that's why they call it Benjamin? I don't know. Mysteries of the rap game. But for some reason, I absolutely love rap. I just can't take it seriously a lot of the time. Like, I can. Like, I can say, like, oh, this, guy, this guy's been through a lot. He's been in the hood, man. He's a brother. And then all of a sudden, I'm like, yeah, I'm trying to show someone else. And it's like, he doesn't really mean that. He's, he's joking. Yeah. And then, obviously, with Tyler, the creator, it's kind of easier to explain. Because, oh, uh, yeah, Tyler, the creator, he's, he's just... He's, he's talking like taking the piss out of everybody else. This is what he does. Jesus freaking Christ, where did you come from? But uh, yeah, with every, every other rappers, it's like, what the freaking hell are you listening to? It's like, um, I'm just listening to this, this song my friend linked me. <laughs> I don't know, it's, it's something like that. Yeah. He sent me it. It's a bit weird, isn't it? <laughs> I don't enjoy it. Downloads as the favorites on YouTube. What is this trap music? Load of garbage. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> Sounds awful. I, I, I prefer dubstep, mate. Get get out. Get out of here. Give me my trap over dubstep, buddy. That's, that's cool, though, isn't it? Like, I love how electronic music has gone from being loud, shabby music that's only played at discos and stuff for chavs and uh, nightgoers and that sort of thing. It's like the only... Music you'd only listen to in a club. Not that I've ever been to a club in my life. And then now electronic music is absolutely everything. We've got, obviously, started drum and bass. Then we've got dubstep. And then we've got trap. And it's like, you've got pretty much everything. It's like going to be... Oh, you've got electro rock, I guess. You've got some weird house music, which is... I would say... I'd kind of put house music along with a few other genres, like dubstep. I don't know, it just sounds really similar to me. But then again, trap and everything just sounds similar. It's just, it's all the same, except it has a different beat. So I, I don't know. We're just weird things, aren't we? It's like, oh, I don't like that. How can I not, I don't like that. It uses the same instruments, the same sounds. It's just in a different beat. I dislike this. Anyway, I should start wrapping this video up because it's gone on for a lot longer than I actually thought it has. I'm going to be going on for an hour if I stop myself. These things go ridiculously quick, like you don't realise how quick these videos go when you're recording them. It's just so much fun to record these longer videos, so uh, anyway, give us a like if you did enjoy this video. It means a lot and helps me a goddamn lot. If, if you do that, I'll love you forever and I will pat you on the back and I'll be like, Yo, this guy, he likes my video. Don't worry, the, you know, he knows me. And then the girls will be like, oh my god, I love you. No, because it's not as if anybody knows who I am. But <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. You see, this is what happens when you need sleep. I should probably go now. Uh, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Thanks ever so much for joining us for the Forza Horizon 2 video. If you've got any video videos, if you want any cars you want me to drift or drive or use in races, I thought somebody walked past me then. I was like, is somebody walking past me? Since when are the people in this game? He's not drifting, he's scraping along the wall. Close enough. I'll see you next time, guys. Peace.